Hey guys, welcome back to your girl's channel. It is your girl Giselle. You can call me Zell for short, whatever your preference is. So today guys, I have a special video for you guys. I am going to be doing a makeup tutorial over this new Laura Mercier Honey Translucent Powder. This is the powder. I got it from Sephora. Super excited about it and also I have a Kevin Aquan concealer that I have never used and I've always wanted to try Kevin Aquan so we're gonna go ahead and test this stuff out for today so yeah if you guys want to stay and watch the video uh, stay tuned let's get into it <laughs> Alright guys, to start off my makeup for today, I am going to be using my e.l.f. Putty Primer and this stuff has really been good to me. I've been using it ever since I got it and if you guys need a new primer, I would highly suggest this because it's super affordable and it works super, super good. And just to speed things up here, I am be I'm going to be going in with my Juvia's Place foundation in the color Putacana. Uh, this foundation is really, really good. It it looks like skin to me. And I got it on sale for $14, so y'all should definitely hit up Ulta and get you a Juvia's Place foundation. As you can see, I have already applied my foundation on my face. And now it's time to try this Kevin Aquan concealer. I'm super excited. Um, the only thing I don't like about Kevin Aquan is that you cannot get it in a store. I actually got this from Sephora online, but they don't carry this in the store, so you kind of have to like eyeball it, like what's your color. So the color that I picked up is the SX08. So that's the color I got. I got the color 8. Hopefully this works out. I'm not sure if it will, but we're going to find out today. Okay. So I'm going to just grab a little concealer. Um... A little concealer, um, concealer brush or whatever. So I'm gonna grab something. If I can grab anything. Where's my brushes at? Where are my brushes at? Uh, let me see here. I guess I could take a little bit. Oh, I'm scared. I'm gonna dab my finger in here. I'm just. Like, oh baby, I might have taken too much. I don't know. Okay. I heard this stuff is like really, really thick, so we don't see how thick it is today. So I'm gonna just like. I feel like I need more. Oh. I feel like I may need no. <laughs> I was gonna say more, but I honestly don't think I would. Wow. Oh my god, do you see that? I don't know if this is the right color for me. Ooh, girl's definitely giving under eye greatness though. Like, oh my god, did I get the right color though? Like, honestly, like, let's see. Do y'all see how my under eyes are looking right now? They are looking very, very bright. Let me put some down there. This is like paint. Oh my gosh. Cause my very like the concealer that I was using the most was my um, my Tarte Shape Tape, and then I found out that um, L'Oreal had the infallible one, so I started using that one. But this right here, this is really really giving. This is like a little goes a really a long way. Usually I would let my concealer just sit on my face as I do my eyebrows and stuff but I'm sorry if y'all can hear my one in the background he's playing but usually I will let my concealer sit underneath my face as I do my eyebrows and everything but for the sake of this video I want to see how good the wear is so for sure oh my god my under eyes are looking long oh my gosh a little literally literally goes a long way and I'm loving the coverage so far um 
This is cute. Okay. I'm going to do my brows. And let's see how the concealer looks underneath the eyes. So I'm going to do my, my brows. Let's see. So I'm going underneath my eyes with some concealer, with this concealer, and seeing how... So this is what my eyes are looking like currently. Oh, I think I may have gotten some makeup in my hair. That's okay. But this is what my eyes and my under eyes are looking currently. I am loving the brightness that it's bringing to my face. Um, I think this is super dope so far. And I literally use the slightest bit of concealer. So yeah. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move on to the Laura Mercier powder and see how this is working okay let's get to the let's get to the tea let's see what what laura mercier is talking about because baby this is a new concealer and we are just wanting to make sure that sis came through for the color girls period so brand new Ooh. that's what it looks like I'm gonna go ahead and dab some underneath my eyes. Oh, I've got some crease on. Okay. This is the difference if you guys can see it. it looks good to me. I like it. Oh, this is a bop. This is cute. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up my makeup and then I'll be back with my final results and let you guys know how I feel about the makeup. So yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, so this is the finishing look. I am completely in love with the outcome, baby. The Kevin Aquan concealer is a whole new flex. Okay, and this Laura Mercier powder, I really, really love it. It's very, very fine. It's not clumpy or anything like that. So I feel like this worked really, really good. Um, now, I'm not going to lie. These products were a bit expensive. I paid about almost $50 for, no, not $50. I paid about $40 something dollars for both of these things. Um, so my overall total turned out to be like $80 something dollars. Um, so, I mean, that's a lot for concealer and um, a powder. Like, you can go to Walmart and get that for way less or like $20. Um, but I definitely want to start to invest more into my makeup uh, because I just, I love makeup. And recently, I've kind of been more into the more subtle side of makeup. I haven't really been doing too much, like too many crazy looks. I've learned to appreciate the natural beats <laughs> of doing your makeup i just kind of don't i haven't really been in the in the mood to go all glam and stuff like that like this is more this right here is this is me like i also want to start getting into like eyelash extensions i think that would be really pretty um but yeah my overall thoughts i love the products they're really really good definitely worth the price i believe like this is some good stuff you know, and what will really determine if it's good or not, you know, if it holds throughout the day. Um, but I mean, I literally dabbed into this like 
literally just the tip of it <laughs> and I was able I was able to manage to get it underneath my eyes on my con underneath my eyebrows and on the tip of my nose so that speaks volume and this I barely used a little bit of this as well so yeah but that concludes today's video I hope you guys like this video if you want to see more videos like this make sure you give this video a thumbs up make sure you like comment and subscribe well giving a thumbs up is liking uh, make sure you like comment and subscribe to your girl's channel and I will see you guys in the next video bye guys <laughs>